my channel this is your girl infinite beauty so today's look is inspired by the oceans as you can see lots of different blues turquoises a little bit of green in there um blue lip um i didn't want to go nude today i just want to go bold all the way all the products will be listed down below i hope you guys really like this tutorial today um trying to come up with a lot of different creative um looks for you guys um let me know below what you like to see next nudes neutrals bold looks glitter looks just whatever you can think of just let me know below and i'll put that on my list of things to do and so um i hope you can hear the video um in post-production if i decide that um my sound was not loud or clear enough i'll probably do a voiceover but i did originally do it as a talk through and the foundation parts will probably be um spat through but as usual i will list all the products so um yeah let's get into the tutorial bye guys Hey guys, I'm back with another one. Today we're doing this look right here. It's inspired by the colors of the ocean. And I'm going to try to do a talk through. But if I don't like the footage, I'm going to end up doing a voiceover. Or if it's too low, you can barely hear me. Or what have you. So, yeah, let's get to it. So, I've already primed my lid. So now, I'm going into Julia's, and I'm going to, uh, no, I didn't go into this one first. I went into this one, and it's the Zulu. So, taking it, and it's going to be my first transition. I'm doing windshield wiper motions. You don't have to apply a lot of pigment because it's the just the transition. And then we're gonna be applying another color, kind of like on top of it. So yeah. So now I'm going into another Julius Place palette. It's the Nubian 2. I'm going to take that color right there. And I'm going to take my Wet n Wild brush. And I'm just applying that kind of like on top of that teal color. So you bring it down. Oh, how are y'all guys feeling? Um, thinking about going to um, twice a week, Wednesdays and Sundays, just to get um, more viewers and to be more interactive using that color right there this and I'm just applying that as well so that's what I'm thinking let me know if you think that is a good idea or if you would rather keep it so weekly once a week. Just blending that. 
as you can see I'm never like really too precise on my blending going back into that green color I just kind of kind of place them a little bit on top of each other and blend but never really too precise with my placement and all of that <coughs> so now I took a little bit I'm using like four Julius Place palettes you guys into the magic palette and I took that color right there and placed that a little bit Flip it over and blend. Use that. Something like that. Might want to add a little bit more of the clear powder color. Just to diffuse it. And I'm working on getting a new camera. I can't decide which one I which one I want. I think I know. I think I want the um, Canon Mark II. But I don't know. Let me know what kind of cameras. If any of y'all are um, vloggers. Uh, what kind of cameras y'all use or what kind you like in the comment. I'm just taking um, my Smashbox Studio Skin Concealer in the color Medium Dark and I just put that on the back of my hand to do this uh, half cut crease situation.
blend that out. Yeah, just like that. I got oh. Let it dry. Because you don't want it to be too wet. Because then it'll streak up your eyeshadow. <coughs> Excuse me. So now we're going to do the first eyeshadow. Which is going to be Buzo out of the uh, Magic Palette. Shadow I'm thinking is Molly out of the Masquerade palette. Even though they do kind of look similar. Just packing the, the color on. Get as close to that line as possible. And for Judy's face, it don't really take that much packing on to get the color that you want. So now I'm going to Buzo in the um, Magic Palette. And you just place in that. Next to each other, using the same brush, just flipped it over. blue color out of the um, masquerade palette and I'm placing that right there
Bela. And putting that on the end. Now I'm going back into um, Asia out the uh, Magic Palette. kids are a little annoying when they know that I'm filming and we're just going to put a little that at the end Just a big blur brush and pat. Like so. And then I'm going to take this color from Zulu small detailer brush and put that in that blank spot Do my um, liner.
notification off camera or put it in the film in the tutorial oh They're going to do it off camera this time, so I'll be back. I'm back. So now I've um, already did my foundation. I'm baking right now, as you can see, because I have to do this um, lower lash line. And I've already applied my falsies. It'll be down below in the description box. So I've applied my white uh, primer eyeshadow stick down below. And now I'm just going to pat that out. Like so. And the first color I'm going to pick up is Buzo in the magic palettes and just apply that right like that and then the next color I picked up uh, was in this one and I picked up Dala or Dalia I don't know how you are supposed to see it and shade dark my powder brush and set all over my face and I even go over my highlight area so it all looks cohesive Oh. 
Go back into dark, deepest. Take a little of container brush. Share, subscribe, subscribe, and like the video, and I'll definitely see you in the next.